All right. Track okay. three from Garth Brooks, Rope in the Wind. Coming back at you with some more Garth Brooks country music. Look at that shirt, man. He is wearing that shirt. <laughs> I'm, I'm glad we can't see the jeans. <laughs> It's almost, it, this is like... That belt buckle is This is like the awesome. opposite side of Bruce Springsteen. Yeah. <laughs> the album is like flipped. Ironic, isn't it? <laughs> and don't you think? Don't you think? <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Being silly now. What's she doing now? What's she Track doing three. now? Track three is from Garth Brooks. All right. This is going to be a sweet song. Oh, you can tell. I'm going to love it. I think I like this one the best so far. Last time I saw her, it was turning colder. But that was years ago. Last I heard, she had moved to Boulder. Yeah, that was coming. But where she's now, I don't know. But there's something about this time of year that spins my head around takes me back makes me wonder what she doing now cause what she's doing now is tearing me apart I've heard this feeling up my mind an empty in my heart I can hear her call Each time the cold wind blows And I wonder if she knows What she's doing now All right. Uh, so far, I like it. So this is a type of country song when I, I've always compared country and R&B. Right. As they're the same thing. Mm-hmm. You know, there it's just presented in a different way. Right. But this is an R and B song, mm -hmm. like a, like a like yep. boys to men could do this song. Right. You know, it's a it's 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 just it's just presented instrumentally and vocally a little differently. Yeah. You know, but his vocal, he is a he's got a really good voice. In fact, I I'd love to hear like an R and B take on a lot of this. Like I I'd love cross genre stuff. Well, I, I think I was showing you the other day that, that song "I Swear." Uh huh. You know, there, there's a country version of that song. Mm -hmm, it's mm -hmm. it, and it, it's beautiful. It's awesome. You know, it's yeah. just it sounds like almost like him, like Garth Brooks singing. Right. You know, I I swear mm -hmm. by the moon. You know, it's very deep and you know, so. All right. Let's keep going. And the slide guitar, of course. I love that instrument. Yeah, it's cool. Just so country. I dialed her own number But no one knew her name Hung up the phone Sat there and wondered If she'd ever done the same I took a walk in the evening To clear my head but tonight I lie here thinking What she doing now Cause what she's doing now Is tearing me apart Filling up my mind And emptying my heart I can hear her call Each time the cold wind blows I wonder if she knows what she's doing now. Is All right, so yeah, it's it. It's a little slow. It's a little slow, and what ends up happening is it it becomes repetitive. It in is the repetitive in yeah. the second verse. I, yeah. I mean, I mean, it is still very relatable. Like we talk about yeah. that a lot. It's, yeah, yep. I mean. Obviously, you know, you're you're a married man and you've never thought of any ex-girlfriend you know, ever in your life. <laughs> never. So, I mean, but everybody has, you know, thoughts of people yep. in their past. Mm -hmm. it, it may not even be a lover, just you know, friends, you yep. know, yep. Uh, people, you know, what, what, you know, what they're up to, you know. Mm -hmm. So, you know, it's definitely very, very relatable. But it, 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 can, it is a little dragging on, kind of, yeah. you know, a little slow. Yep. And it was only, what, it's only about three and a half minutes long. So He's we had got some short four, songs. We like, got 40 seconds to go. Wow. Tearing me apart Feeling 
You paused it before, right before you paused it, I was expecting a break, mm-hmm. and I thought there was going to be a chord change, like it was going right. to drop, and it was going to pick, like the vocals were all going to pick up. Mm-hmm. I, I, I heard that coming, um, even though I heard, I, I have heard the song before, just not enough to really know it. The chorus, I re- right. recognize, yes. you know. But, I mean, uh, I I am obviously super familiar with the the structure, you know, verse, yeah. chorus, verse, chorus, outro. Yeah, yeah. But I mean. I don't like when it's that verse, repetitive. Chorus, very similar verse, exact same chorus, right? Exact same outro. Like, yeah, yeah, I get what you're saying. Like the 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 verse, a lot of times, like even the uh, the the pitch or whatever, uh-huh. you know, it changes. Maybe maybe some harmony comes in. There's a an extra guitar that adds or right. something. You know, it, yeah, it was very. And the the chorus sometimes the chorus has in. Most of my favorite songs, the chorus is not exactly the same. Every, yeah, it, it does change a bit sometimes, you know. Um, but that 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 is a structure of a pop song, right? Yeah, you know, you listen, you know, listen to any pop song mm-hmm. that you know, major, major, like "She Loves You" or something. The uh-huh. Beatles, it's it's the same exact yeah. thing over and over. Um, but you know, it's country music, and it's yeah. and it, it was it was a sweet song. It's nice, not bad. Yeah, you know, it, it, it's progressively getting uh, you know, the better getting better as we from go from the first song. Yeah. <laughs> So that's good, you know. So hope you guys uh, enjoyed the song. Let let us know what you guys think about the song, and uh, you know, come come see us for the next one, track four. Track four we'll, coming we'll, up next. We'll, coming up next. Thanks, right. guys. See ya.